Hey guys, uh, this is Dr. Vinod and uh, what about today? Today I am going to upload a video on uh, you know how to fix the problem for uh, you know, game for uh, Windows Live in Windows 8 64 uh, bit uh, version. I don't know whether it will work on 32 or not. I, I have no idea. I don't know how it uh, worked for me. Uh, truthfully I also don't know so uh, the point is like I uh, I was searching for the you know the solutions in the internet and I found a few solutions I think two solutions uh, I've tried one was uh, to copy uh, everything you know all the X live DLLs for uh, that is your game for Windows live DLLs from um, you know system uh, wow 64 to uh, system 32 and second one was um, second one was a, uh, one website i searched okay i'll tell you i'll for, put the link in the description mm. so first one i i copied to the folder and uh, it didn't work for me you know, uh, I copied everything and uh, tried to run the game. There was no pop up for uh, this thing, Games of Windows Live. Then I went to the uh, website and I followed the description from there, whatever uh, it was given. So, this is the website. Uh, the description is, it is pretty nicely given here. So, uh, you need to follow everything and it actually works it actually worked for me uh, you know just uh, I uh, installed the you know first I uninstalled the uh, games for windows live whatever their whichever files were associated with it you know both there are two files in the control panel you can see and you uninstall the program and then um, you need to reboot after rebooting then uh, you need to download this uh, uh, link which is given here and uh, then you after the download there you go it is from the xbox live only download the client and then uh, after doing that uh, when the download is finished you just need to follow the last two that has that are very important you need to uh, do everything whatever it is written there okay so uh, after downloading <coughs> Uh, you need to change the, uh, you know, compatibility settings for Windows uh, for it for Windows 7 and install it as uh, um, run it as uh, administrator. And after that, I I did that and uh, I ran the game. It was pretty nicely running and everything was happened. The uh, you know the uh, games for Windows Live pop-up also came and uh, after that uh, it started um, you know downloading the profile and uh, after downloading the profile it gave me an um, option to you know update the uh, games for windows live and uh, I uh, and if you don't update it you know you know you'll not be able to sign in that's uh, that really sucks so um, I updated it and uh, then after that I restarted the game and then it was it was still it still was not working so the last thing what I did was I just went to the uh, system you know system wow 64 uh, and searched for uh, X live you know you if you write X L I V and uh, search for it uh, I think I'm still searching. Hold on, I'll show you. Uh, there you can see something, uh, but not everything is coming. Wait. I have to go to you know system wow 64 and it will search faster ok 
okay let me directly go to that same folder okay now you, you can see this uh, except for the folder everything is there uh, there are five files you need to uh, copy all of them and uh, this is after the update okay uh, after the game uh, has updated you know everything then you just go to games folder games directory uh, and there you'll find the binaries and in the binaries uh, hold on there is binaries and in there that is windows 32 win 32 you know you have to paste it there i have already done it okay and then uh, find this next live install.host.exe you need to change the compatibility settings for uh, windows uh, 7 and you need to, uh, uh, and change this uh, you know you have to give it uh, administrator level 